we're a company that's focused not just on flying people, but really creating the markets, creating the products, creating the services, creating the reasons to be in space. And when you provide that access, you say, what is it that you need in space? We can help you get that. Axion's objective is to increase access to countries and people and investigators to go to orbit. We want to have more folks interested in commercializing space to actually use it as a tool and develop things, products that might be used here on Earth. We can do all the research certification, all the research preparation work that's needed. We can do the integration for those payloads, which means that you get all of the hardware and the software and the crew procedures and the crew training together. We can do the cargo services, where you pack everything in kits so that when the crew opens them on orbit, they have everything they need for a certain project. We have some amazing partners that we're working with. National Stem Cell Foundation is actually doing research on Parkinson's and MS. The Sanford Stem Cell Institute is doing tumor organoid research. Our ability to really accelerate the development of those proof of concept studies provides an opportunity for us to help people see science from a completely different perspective and to really do things with more flexibility and get as much science as we possibly can out of each one of these missions. These are the differences that we're seeing with commercial space stations and private astronaut missions. When I think of building commercial markets in low Earth orbit, we're really expanding the definition of global to include 250 miles up. We are doing it now. We are operating. We are opening up access to space. But the future is going to require us to take even more steps. And we've got a head start on all of that with all these missions that we're doing now. Today, it's a few nations. Tomorrow, it should be many nations. And it should be a diverse ecosystem just like it is on Earth today.